Hey guys, it's British Brother back again, and I just finished getting the last two refinements for the um, Cinnaba Spindle. Ningguan for the Geo Damage Bonus, Razor for the Defense Shred, Zhongli for the Shield and the whatever, and Albedo because he's <laughs> So, his current build right now as a balanced sort of build is this as his circlet. I mean, as flower, really good crit rate. You might think this is the other way around. This crit, this crit damage, but not this crit. This is crit rate. And this is crit damage. This is uh, the flower, the feather. It's full on crit rate. This is the sense. Some crit damage. That's it. You got the geo damage bonus, a bunch of crit damage, some energy recharge, some defense. You have the circlet, crit rate, some defense, some crit damage. So that's yeah, that's that's his build. No Zhongli shield or anything. Let's start with zero stacks first. So that's 9k I think. Okay, that's, that's all non crits. Seriously 6k. Yeah, 14k. Yeah, 16k with the damage. Oh, so with strongly shield. No, 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 Cause I had 4 stacks all the time Cause he didn't show me decreasing in stacks Right so If that's at R1 14k to 6k so that's like a 2k increase I think It's like a 14% increase I guess around there I mean it takes in it, we're not taking into account a lot of other stuff I'm not entirely sure about math and whatever and all the theory crafting But I can probably expect like a 20 to 30 increase if I go from R1 to R5 Before that, I actually want to try with all the buffs Like with Razor's uh, defense decrease as well Okay, so all I need to do <laughs> Oops, doesn't matter I get Zayn out, I get Ningguang Sting out That's already ATK Alright And then I get 21k 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 And how do you get 23k for the last hit? I'm still not sure about that 22k That one, that time I'm not entirely sure about it Alright, I have to take crit rate food Despite having like almost 60 crit rate I say mage Sounds like it. It's 21k. Okay, 21k. 20k. Nice. Okay, that's a 21k. Oh, no, that's a 21k. Okay, so with all the buffs, that's 21k. And let me R5 it. Oops. Let me R5 it. Alright. Wait, what? Oh! Cool. That good shit. But yeah, so at R5, basically it doubles the, pass the passive. So now it's 80% of defense to AOE. So that times 80%. So I get another 2. So I get 2.2k damage increase, I guess. We talk to him again, and now we can try. Um, just to double check, let me destroy the shield real quick. Get rid of my shield. 
Oh, I forgot it's strong <laughs> Uh Alright. So, just to make sure that I'm not doing anything wrong, I want to see the damage he gets. 13k. Seven k. Twelve k. Hold on. The effect will be clear upon one second. Correct. With a crit hit, sixteen k. Eighteen k. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong. But yeah, eighteen k. Eighteen k. Thirteen k. So 13k is probably without the buff, without the buff. So Zhongli shield. 16k, no it's without the buff. 21k. This 21k is only Zhongli shield. GRS. 24k? 24k? How about his buff? Nothing different right? Yeah, nothing different. So, 24k from... 20k, 21k, all the way to 24k, goodness. Let me try that with all the other buffs as well. Just to be opti just to be optimal with this. Let me try in C4 again. 7 seconds. 10 seconds, so I should do Ningguang Sting first. I should go to Ningguang Sting first. Ah, so, hold on, I can't hit. In here, and then boom. 24k Okay 22k Let's see if I Go here And then 25k 27k With Goro and with only 100 crit damage I'm definitely going to be able to hit uh, 30k with Goro also try with a full crit damage deal after this. This could take your turn. Well, I love Ningguang C6. I actually just got a C6 recently. Alright, so... I gave Albedo my full crit damage build. I'm not sure if that's with 4 stacks. I think it's more at 4 stacks. So he has 186 crit damage um, and 87.7 Probably more, I'll just wait for a while So, 3.1k defense 186.8 crit damage and 99.4 deal damage bonus, should be Okay, so at 0, zero stacks you'd have 2.9k defense, 75.4 geo damage bonus. I am going to take crit rate food so that I can crit more often. I'll put his E first so that I don't get one attack on the first hit. Unless it doesn't crit, then too bad. 11k. Alright. Alright. 21k. 24k. This is a, oh yeah, this, by the way, this is a crit damage, so obviously you're gonna do that. Crit rate mark check. 36. <laughs> okay, please, crit already. Oh, no, I don't have all day. Just so you know, um, Zhongli does damage before his shield is put up. So this. 25k damage that you see here is dealt before I get the elemental res decrease from his shield. Cool. Know, 25k, I think. How about with the shield? 12k non 39k crit. Alright. Let's just try with everyone else. Nah, everyone else is lost. 37k already. Wow. Wow. This is without food bars, by the way. 34. Forty-four. 
Oh my god, 41 k Wow. Let's get him with this bird for fun. I don't have a C2, unfortunately. I'm not going to try for a C2 because I'd rather save for another character. Be Ito, and Goro, or Yaimiko. Yeah. So, that with a full crit damage build, obviously, this is probably not exactly realistic. Because without the food buff, it'll be 24 crit rate. But I want to try this with Goro now. <laughs> Okay, so for whatever reason, no matter how many times I tried, I just couldn't do more damage. I even did the same build and the same rotation of the characters, but the highest I could only do was um, 21, no, 24,000 damage. Maybe it's because some of the buffs ran out, or maybe the Vertui just had really high GRS, and I just have no idea. If that's the case, it would explain a lot because the highest I could do with my regular build on Masanori was 27,000 damage. Also, I tried seeing how much I could do against a weakened mechanical array, but since I was using the uh, crit damage build, I couldn't crit at all. Sag. Hmm, do I have anything else? No. Anyways, that's about it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.